Hola clase, this is Senora Doolin. Um, hopefully you've had a chance to look at the what is a cognate notes and lesson. I'm going to explain to you a little bit more in person what a cognate is. If I had you in middle school, then you might remember talking about this. Cognates are your friend in Spanish class. This makes learning Spanish so much easier if you can learn to recognize the cognates and use them to your advantage. So what is a cognate? Basically, it's a word that looks and sounds the same in English and Spanish, and it means the same thing. So it looks the same in both languages, and it means the same. I'll give you some examples. Elefante. Elefante is an elephant, okay? It looks and sounds the same. I'll give you another example. Hospital. Hospital. It looks and sounds the same in Spanish and English. If you can learn to recognize these, it's really gonna make your life a whole lot easier. However, there are words that you might think are a cognate, but they're actually a false cognate. So an example is éxito. What do you think éxito sounds like? Probably exit. It doesn't mean exit, it means success, like a successful person. So um, there are words that maybe you think are a cognate, but they're not. And the only way you can figure that out is if your teacher teaches you. So we'll be talking more about that later. But for now, I just wanted to come to you. I'm in my classroom, I wish you guys were here but um, just wanted to explain to you a little bit more about cognates. Hasta luego, chao.